Good morning, it is Saturday, December 26th. It is 7.17 a.m. My cousin's already over playing games, right there. That's Lulin. Well, say hello. So today, we're just gonna relax, take it easy. We have nothing planned today, so just like a rest day. The last couple days were kinda hectic because of, um, because of uh, Christmas, leading up to Christmas. Um, my brother's still asleep. Look at him. I don't know what we're going to do today, but it might be a short video because we have nothing planned. I'm sitting in my uh, the living room right now. There's a fire right there. All houses in Uma have a fireplace or like a fire, a fire spot, I guess. So fire is very important because they cook on the fire. They like use it for warmth because there's no heat and they use it for light. It's very common for people to gather around the fire and just like talk and sit. We sit on these traditional Naga stools, like this thing. What are these called, Mom? Mura. They're called Mura. Mura. It's like a stool. Fire is very important. Also, food. We eat with our hands. I don't think I, know, I mentioned that. I'm not very good at it, but I'm getting better. Hey, Lulin. Along and Lulin. Are you hungry? What are you making? Go. So the last time we had chow was at a restaurant. But this is a homemade stuff. So Uncle Lee just cooked us some chow. Awesome cook. This is basically like lo mein, but Indian, Indian version. It's all got the Indian spices. Kind of, it's got some cabbage on top, you see. Also, the, you get the spicy ketchup. Bam. Yeah. Juices. There's mine. We're all done. Except for linear. Now we're gonna eat some, uh, read some yams. Bongulashu, right? Naga cakes, as we call them. Mmm, delicious. Tastes kind of like tapioca, I guess. So the guys are making some rope out of bamboo. They gotta split the bamboo and then they gotta wind it into a rope. We just bought a moose. So a villager killed a moose and so we're buying it off of them. It's like, I think a hundred bucks. I mean, climb done. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Christmas. No, you're wrong. <laughs> We're going on a little field trip. We're gonna visit my Auntie Younger's farm. It's like nearby. I'm still in my PJs. The kids are freaking out. Chris is wearing pajamas and flip flops. Oh. 
So this is the tea garden. Walking around. The kids are here. Um, I think there's cows somewhere. top of the hill of the tea gardens and you can see in the background there's uh, the Mugulchung, the San, next to Uma and then all the tea everywhere and also there's cows right there somewhere there now we're gonna go see the bees buzz buzz yo honey what? Alright, so this, we just jacked the honey from the hive. That's real honeycomb right there. That's the stuff. Oh, it's dripping. I feel like I feel like Winnie the Pooh. Huh. I gotta say the, the jungle honey was better. The jungle honey was better in our previous vlogs, but this stuff's pretty good nonetheless. You can see that it is oozing honey. All right, we've had our fill of honey. What is this? What is this? Lanier's had his fill of honey, right, Lanier? What is this? Honey. What is this? Honey. What is this? Yeah. Hey. What is this? Like He's had his honey. We're taking some honey for the road and these little green uh, banana leaves. So let's go, Lydia. Ready? Waka! We're heading back to uh, our grandparents' house, Uchi and Apu's house. I'll be riding in that car and not in that car, this car. Apparently my uncle is bringing a moose or something. Something about a moose. No. Mm. Moose is here. Hey, the moose is here. Definitely smells like uh, fresh game. Stephen, how? No, it smells like ass. Oh. 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 So they're butchering the uh, moose right now. I'm not gonna film it because it's a little too gruesome, I feel, for the camera. It has liver, lungs, pancreas, and uh, meat from the from the back from the backbone. So uh, I'm just gonna end the vlog here. <laughs>
Come brighten my. <laughs> no, 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 no,